Hey guys, welcome to Lounge TV. I have some exciting news for you all. Look at this house that we bought. I'm, oh, by the way, I'm in Hoob Sound, Florida right now. And my voice probably echoes because this house echoes a little bit. But check this out. Here's the game room we got here. And a little, little porched in area here. There's the yard and there's the road right there. I'll give you a little tour of the house right now. So this is the living area. Got the prices right on right now because that's what us old people down in Florida watch. We, we watch the prices right and stuff like that. Uh, so here's the kitchen over here. As you can see, this is a pretty big kitchen. That's one of the reasons we love this place. I mean, that's a lot of a lot of area for some cooking and stuff. Nice and nice and bright and white and everything. Um, I tweeted out a picture of this one road that we were on that looked like a tunnel, and here's a painting of it right here, and it's a big painting, really big. So here's the bedroom over here. Pretty nice, isn't it? Yeah. Got a nice TV in here. What I really like about this place, or I love about this place, is it's nice and bright. Uh, I can't show you the bathroom right now because my wife's showering in there. Um, and then we have another bedroom over here. And my wife has all her stuff over in this one right now. And, and basically, that's the whole house, kind of. And, well, the inside part of it anyway. But let's go to the outside and check that out. It's pretty humid, so the, the camera's probably going to fog up because we are in Florida. But it's got a screened-in area out here. There's a garage over there. Yeah, it's starting to fog up a little bit now. Let me wipe off the screen real fast. Excuse me while I do that. Yeah, that's better. And you got a little sink out here and you know, that would have to go, of course, have to have a, uh, have to have a gas grill here. And a little area in here that's screened in. Backyard over here, house right there. And, you know, there's lizards all over the place. We'll see if we see any. But I want to show you what's over, out over here. Oh, it, it's fogging up pretty bad right now. Let me uh, clean that off. That's better. It's probably going to fog right back up again. Oh, there's now there's a smear in it. Oh. Is that better? I think that's better. The, the screen on top has a lot of smudges on it. But let's go outside here <clears throat> and take a little little tour of this house. So, there's our rental right now. It's got some kayaks. Is it fogging up again? Come on. I should have left the camera sit outside for a little while, let it get used to it, but I did not. Okay, so here's the side of the house over here. There's a road out there, but this is what's interesting right here, what we have. It is a butterfly garden. That's right, you heard me. Butterfly garden. And there's a butterfly. He just came over to say hi. But it's got a... Uh, it's got a lot of flowers here. It's pretty cool looking. It's got butterflies all over the place. I don't know if you can see them on the camera or not. A lot of seating area. For some strange reason, whenever I come out over in this area, I feel like I gotta pee. I don't know what exactly the reason is but uh yeah so yeah this is pretty pretty nice in here it's got some interest there's some spanish moss right there interesting plants and decor here at the and you know what's really cool about this yeah this is cool right here but uh what's really cool about this this is that you know i grew up one of the things i used to love when i was a kid was butterflies like I used to catch them. I had butterfly net and all this stuff, you know. To, and I used to catch butterflies all the time. Unfortunately, being a kid, you don't know any better, and you actually are killing them to make them display them and stuff like that. And I appreciate them a lot more now. I mean, I love the way they looked and everything when I was a kid. But I, down here, there's all different kinds, and uh, I wish I could see one that is 
that is different. Like there was a big giant yellow one yesterday. It wasn't a tiger swallowtail either. It was a, just a yellow one. I see the black swallowtails over here, but we have them at home. So they're nothing fancy. Um, yeah, you can see this one flying around. He's coming, kind of coming over here. And there's, uh, yeah, there's a lot of black swallowtails that I see. Not a, not a whole variety today. Yesterday there was these other ones, that, um, different kind of black and yellow one that I never saw before. That was kind of cool. But yeah, this is this area is really nice right here. And uh, down this way, um, if my wife gets out of the shower, we're going to take a walk and I'm going to turn the camera back on and show you where there's a dock over there and uh, a public dock that you can go to. And, uh, and, and uh, the river's right there. I forget, uh, Indian River or something like that it's called. Um, but anyway, yeah, it's really nice here. And now I have to tell you that, no, we did not buy this house. In fact, this is a uh, VRBO and we are here for my wife's mother's 80th birthday party. That's what we came down for. They live a little ways away from here. Um, and we rented this house just to stop here. However, while we're, we're going out later on and doing a little house hunting later on. Truth be told, uh, even this little house right here, yeah, I can't afford that. Maybe I should start like a GoFundMe account for Uncle Larry's um, retirement home. <laughs> no, just kidding, guys. Um, but no, I, I, I don't know that I'm going to be able to afford to move down to Florida at all. But it is a place that we would like to come down. Um, I don't know. It's just very, very expensive here. We're going to look at places a little bit more inland today just to see if uh, if it is something, you know, if we can find something that we can actually maybe maybe afford. Um, and we'll see what happens. But I just wanted to show you guys this place that we're at because it's really cool. I could definitely live in this house. Even though it's only two bedroom, one bathroom, could live there. I don't need anything more than that. Um, and it's nice. It's uh, It's actually today's the best day weather wise out of all the days it's not really that hot and humid out here it is because opposed to inside the house uh, but it's it's really not that bad it's comfortable there's a little breeze too uh, yesterday and the other day i think there was more thunderstorms and stuff so but that's florida for you so um like i said i'm gonna turn the camera back on when we go for a walk let me show well i'll show you the front of the house first um and then yeah we're gonna go for a walk down the road and and give you guys a good picture of all uh, the neighborhood around here. I could definitely live here, like I said, if I could only afford it. See, here's the front of the... Oh, I just heard a lizard over there. Um, here's the front of the house. As you can see. Pretty nice. Uh, it looks like I'm going to have to get the trash can because the trash people came. But yeah, it's pretty nice. And like I said, there's usually lizards all over the place out here. I don't see any right now. But I heard one over here. There's one in here somewhere. Where are you at? Where are you hiding? You in there somewhere. Yeah, I don't want it to come out and attack me. I've seen some really big ones too out here. But it's got a nice front yard out here, as you can see. Yeah, it's pretty nice. I, these interesting vines are growing up in this trees. Let me show you. I'll show you this one over here because it's a lot closer. But check this out. They kind of look like cactus a little bit. Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit. Let's see if I can remember how to zoom in on this camera. There we go. They got like little spikes on them too. Weird, isn't it? I don't know what they're called. Maybe one of you guys out there know what it's called. Did I zoom it all the way out? I don't know. I suck with the camera. Of course, Tom didn't come down with us. He's home. But, uh, yeah, so this is the front yard. And I will, like I said, I'll turn the camera back on when we go out to, uh, to the water and take a little tour over there. And then when we go out looking at other houses today in different areas, I'll show you what that's like too. But I just went into the shade, didn't I? Well guys, until then, I'm gonna shut the camera off. 
and I turned it back on because I didn't get in the house but there's one of our friends right down here as you can see hey buddy here on lounge TV whoa 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 where are you going oh you got some place to go huh you got some place to be you don't like being on TV whoa you don't like being on lounge TV whoa whoa we're gonna cause you oh I just thought I'd let, let you guys see there's so there was one the other day that I saw out here and it had a orange head and an orange tail and it was probably about 12 inches long but uh, I didn't have the camera near me and it went off so fast that uh, they don't even let you get very close to them so it was kind of cool looking though all right turn the camera back on in a few minutes all right so now we are on our walk and uh, this is the house right next door to us right here We'll just peek in there a little bit while we go by. Nonchalant. Yeah, look at that. Well, that's got a beautiful, big, giant door. Did you see that? Wow. Anyway, guys, this, uh, this house is for sale. So I'm thinking if we do start that GoFundMe for Uncle Larry's retirement home. Oh, there's a big lizard there running across the road. I don't know if I got it in there or not. But anyway, this is for sale. Look, it's got its own private dock. Imagine the vlogs I could get here, guys. Like, I could give you guys some real legit videos from here. Look at all the adventures I could have out there. I only need 3.5 million. <laughs> That's all. That's all I would need for that place. But look at this. They got a little private dock right here, too. That could be the house across the street. Oh, that could be the house across the street. Might not be them. But it doesn't matter that other house right there on the water 3.5 mil yeah. must be nice to be the be on the side of the haves and not the have-nots huh oh wow i thought that was animal over there staring at me i couldn't show it but uh yeah so anyway so this is this is the walk we're going to this is the indian river right Indian River. You know, we have a, there's an Indian River in Delaware. There's probably lots of them. A little breezy out today, guys. This, and it's really, really comfortable because usually it's, uh, usually it's not so comfortable here. But it's nice. I don't feel very much humidity at all. I kind of feel like I'm back in Jersey right now. Nah, Jersey wasn't this warm, though. It was all rainy. But yeah, look at the sky. The sky's all nice and blue. First time that since we've been down here that has. Here's a dock right here. This is not the private. This is somebody's own private dock, I believe. Matter of fact, I'm going to get this house over here. Look at all this property that they have. That's pretty nice. Pretty sweet. Hmm. Yeah, so... Oh, the water's clear. Oh, there's a couple boats coming down here. You can see the bottom pretty good in the right here. So you can't go fishing naturally down here because this is all like, see, no trespassing. You know what that means? Get off. Even though around our way that doesn't stop people, does it? You put up no trespass sign, people still show up. Yeah, there's one that that's the public one for everybody around here. Watch it. There's a car coming down here. I don't know why you came to this side. Oh, look, there's a lizard right there. Can you see him? And there's a boat out there with a bunch of people hanging over the side. Now, in Jersey, if you were hanging over the front of the boat like that, you would get stopped by the Marine Police. Can't do that in Jersey. Probably not allowed to here either because it's not safe, but uh, they're a little bit different down here. A little bit more carefree. You should see, I, I, you know, I have to say, maybe not all drivers, but Florida drivers. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe because they're all uh, Jersey and Philly uh, people that come down here. I don't know. 
all retirement people, they pull out right in front of you, they don't care. It's like, oh, you're in my way. So down here, there's some more houses. These are all houses we can't afford. We're just showing you where we're staying. We're not really showing you anything about us even thinking about moving around here. Oh, now the heat just hit me. <laughs> All of a sudden, right here. That's weird. Is that what happened? Some, some was behind a cloud before. No. Oh. Boats up on their lifts. They, they, I think down here they like to, uh, almost all the boats they keep out of the water mm -hmm. because the algae would grow so fast on the bottom of them. And the barnacles probably. It's one of the things when I had my boat, I would always have to clean off the bottom every year, even though you bottom paint it. That's the one thing they don't have to really bottom paint it, I don't think. They probably just put some kind of layer of uh, wax or something on it. Do I miss having a. You can hear the wake from that boat, can you? Do I miss having a boat? Yeah, I do. But at the same token, I don't miss, miss all the money that. Uh, that the, the boat work. I never minded the work on oh. the boat okay. I, I, I did not care for painting the bottom of it but I didn't mind all the all the work on it where this is a long walk to this dock Almost there. oh is that where them benches are up there yep. so this is just a public dock I guess that you can go in there and go and go what fishing or crabbing off of it is that what you can do I don't know, unless there's a sign that says no fish and no crabbing. But yeah, so what is this building up here? Do you know? Oh, it's a regular house. It's not yeah. like a store or anything. I don't think so. Now, this, is, this might be a house that we could probably afford over here. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, never mind. The house is probably... Even though it looks like it needs a lot of work, I bet you it's probably like half a million dollars. Everything down here is really expensive near the water anyway. And so we just wanted to come walk down here to show you that this area with the, uh, and it has like a private dock here. It doesn't say, or, pri or public. Can't have any alcohol here, so that kind of sucks. But yeah, so there it is guys. We're not walking all the way to it. No, we're not. No, I don't need to. There's a big lizard um, Yeah, so this is the area um, Get over on the side, will you? Somebody doesn't want to be on camera, but always is in the way. I don't understand it. Oh, why don't you tell me there's a puddle there? You push what? Huh? I heard something <laughs> Anyway guys, this is our little walk that we did today well, yeah, I hear a boat. I can't see it. Let's see. Oh, yeah. There's one of the halves. Yeah, there's one of the halves. And then I'll show you a have not. Oh, there he is. Anyway, guys, there's our little walk. We're going to get in the car now and take a ride and go look at some areas Can where. where yeah. Where we can uh, actually afford, possibly, and so we're going to go look at a few houses today, guys. And I'll take you guys with us. So I'll turn on the camera periodically and give you guys a little look. I just, just, just definitely wanted to show you this area. Like I said, it's beautiful. There's no doubt about that. You gotta love all the palm trees, right? Mm -hmm. Palm trees and blue sky, nothing like it. Nothing like it, except for the only thing better would be. A corona in hand right now. Yeah. I think I have one left at the house. Yep. Hey guys, can you see this lizard right here on this tree? Oh. How much? Oh, sucker. Oh, he ducked behind a tree. Let's see if I can see him. Oh, every time I walk around a tree, he goes the other way. He's like way over here right now. I think he disappeared. If I walk over to this side, he goes to the other side. Can you? All right, I'll stay back like this and try to zoom in on him then. Where's he at? Where? Oh, I see him. His hit up. Guys, 
Hopefully I got him right at the beginning. I don't know if I did. That sucked. They're too fast. They're shy too. Yeah. All right, so I wanted to turn the camera back on. Yeah, I have my hat this way because let me turn it around because it's the sun was pretty bright. But uh, yeah, this house we walked by earlier and check that out. Let's see if I can zoom in. It's blurry when you zoom in. Hmm. Very blurry when you zoom in. But anyway, they're. I, they're just little statues, um, but they look really real. <laughs> I don't know what they're exactly supposed to be of, but uh, they looked real. Mm -hmm. At first, I mean, I, we, when we first walked down here, we had to do a double take because we thought they were something real. Just thought I'd show you guys that. Right, we're on our trip right now. Right now, there's just a bunch of nothing. Except for that land's for sale right there. That's what I could go for, a bunch of land, but it looks kind of wet here. It's real wet. Look, there's a door just floating along. But yeah, this is uh, not a whole lot around here. Except for land for sale. Wonder how much... See, see, I could, uh, I could go for, like, having a couple acres down here, but land's expensive down here, too. Everything's expensive down here. We went to the supermarket. I think everything's priced almost ten dollars. Doesn't matter what you get. Want some lunch meat? Ten dollars. Want some cheese for that lunch meat? Ten dollars. Want some bread? Ten dollars. Oh, boy. Well, seemed like it. Yeah. So uh, yeah, this is. There's not a whole lot to show you right in this area. Except for look, there's a truck there, and the first thing I notice is he needs his tarp fixed because it's flapping. I don't know if you can even see it on here. Man, everything's real far away on the screen. I gotta zoom in a little bit. A teeny tiny little screen. Hey, what are you trying to say? That wasn't a euphemism. Anyway, the, yeah, the tarp is flapping in the wind. And as a guy who used to do tarps, that's a cardinal sin. Because that's what tears the tarps up when they're not tied down. They just flap and then they tear up. But yeah, I don't even have anything exciting to show you guys. Oh, there's 318 acres for sale. Can't imagine how much that would cost. I don't know what an acre goes for down here. But I know just little lots cost a lot. Oh, and here you go, guys. This, this is the telltale sign that you don't belong in this area. That you need to get away from here and because you can't afford it. When uh, you see this fenced in area right here, look at it. All along here, you know what this is? It's a polo club. Yeah. That's when you know you're out of your leg. When there's a polo club around. Yep. There it is. And just to show you, I'm not lying, there's the sign right there. I hope you could read it. Why my wife does 90 miles an hour past it. Or, you know, 55. Yeah. Well, I just wanted to show you. Basically, I turned the camera on so I could show you that because I wasn't sure exactly where it was because we saw it on our way down. And I was like, uh, yeah, you can't, aff you can't afford that area. If there's a polo club, we don't belong there. Not at all. All right, I'll turn it back on when we get to some place where there's actually some houses and houses for sale. We are at trying to get this zoomed out we were in st lucie uh st lucie county st lucie county right in now. a quarter of a mile Fort pierce turn left on summit street and we have the waves app telling us where to go yeah uh yeah so let me just show you a little bit of this area here it's not a bad looking area Really see. Oh, Turn wow. left. Well, some of the areas aren't so great looking. Yeah. Some yeah. of the areas are alright. I can't really tell what the uh, what a lot of these houses look like because they they're all trying to keep it private on us. Seems like your side of the street has all the more open houses and stuff. Well, there's a pool. There's a 
giant manatee mailbox. I pity the fool that don't have a pool. That's one of the things. We gotta have a pool down here, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Turn left on Summit Street. Okay, we're turning left right here. This is a bad looking house right here. Try not to hit the yeah. In a quarter of a mile. Turn right on edge. Oh, that's Road. a cute little house right there. They're tight in here though. Mm -hmm. Very tight guys and, and that's one of the things that you know Larry I, Uncle Larry doesn't want one at all. A tight tight area. Um, Uncle Larry needs a space. I don't see no space around here. You know, there's a little yard right there, but that house is cute too. It's hard to, isn't it hard to believe that I, I mean I grew up in this city, but I've been much longer out in the uh in the country living so it's I don't know if I could take this I mean I know a lot Turn of you right guys on Edgevale Road yeah no idea. That way might be is Road. quite annoying um, it's just that I know a lot of you, you guys arrived. destination is on your left All right. this thing's annoying the crap out of me mm -hmm. um, turn left it's okay we'll turn left how many times you gotta tell us I'm sorry. I'm raging Turn against... left on Edgevale Road. Okay, you told us <laughs> twice already. Turn left on Edgevale Road. We just did! In 300 feet. Turn left on Edgevale Road. Just shut up! <laughs> well, so, yeah, so, I, you know, this is not my kind of... In 300 feet. Oh turn my left gosh. on Edgevale Road. 300 feet. I'm, 300 feet. I'm gonna. S turn left on Edgevale Road. <sighs> In 300 feet. Turn left on Edgevale Road. Why does it keep In saying it? Feet. What? Turn did we miss a? Edgevale did we miss a turn? Turn Something left. Happened. Yes, we did. So where's this house for sale at? We missed it. We did. Yeah. We, oh. had to, we were supposed to turn right. Oh. When there were cars there and we, I couldn't turn. Oh. So we weren't listening. So we gotta back, go back and figure out how to turn around. All right, guys. Uh, when we get in front of the house, maybe I'll show you what the house looks like that uh, we came all this way to to look at. Oh, I just oh, okay. You didn't like the area, so what's the point in looking at the house? Right, that's true. I don't like. Well, I don't like the. Yeah, this is too tight. I I can't live like that. I will not be happy. I'd be I know. I'd be staying in the house. Every it's the car. That was weird. I'd be staying in the house every day. I can't find my immersed okay there. All right, well, you know what? I don't like the area. Unless there's houses that are further, you know, spread more apart, but uh, we have to do more research. Yep. All right, guys, well, that was fun. So uh, I'll turn it back on uh, at some point. Well, we're back home now, but like I said before, didn't find anything. I don't know that we will find anything. We'll do some more researching on the computer and stuff like that. We might have to talk to a real estate agent. Uh, I have no idea what's going to go on, but I'll keep you informed on that. Hope you enjoyed this vlog. It's beautiful down here. I love the heat. You guys know that already. So, hey, we didn't find anything, but... We didn't really come down here expecting to find anything. We came down here because we had a party to go to and we got to see fam you know, my wife's family and everything and that meant a lot. So guys, until next time, grab yourself something cold to drink. Oh, wait a second. Here, hold on for a second, guys. Grab yourself something, maybe while you're getting something. Okay, here we go. Grab yourself something cold to drink. Put your feet and relax. I'll meet you at the lounge or in Hope Sound or somewhere else in the future because there are other places we're going to soon.